We had uh, some heavy rain yesterday for Monday, push into daily rainfall record territory for a lot of central portions of the nation in areas of Arkansas, Texas, Missouri, Kansas. Over in Nogales, Arizona, all you need is eight one hundredths of an inch to get a daily record of rain yesterday. I'm tracking uh, some uh, pretty heavy rain already out the door this morning again in the middle of the nation. If I had to t uh, choose a interstate where it has some of the worst driving conditions this morning, Interstate 44 up and down Missouri and I-55 into Illinois, some one to three inch rainfall totals are expected, I think, today in areas of Missouri, Illinois and surrounding areas. Be mindful, heavy rain, low visibility, could be some localized flooding out there to start off the day. Uh, later on, we'll have a risk of severe weather, mainly damaging winds in areas of the southeast United States, along and east of the Mississippi River, where there is a slight risk in the yellow. Can't rule out some spin-ups of tornado activity and isolated large hail. We had some uh, uh, localized severe weather potential earlier this morning already. Above average warmth to the east, below average warmth to the west, 78 for a high in Atlanta today, and still some frosty and freezing temperatures in the Intermountain West and Upper Midwest. It is late, late October after all, and we're still watching for that cold and snow to line up. Areas of the Cascades, Rockies later this week, Rockies west of uh, western Colorado, some heavy mountain snow is still expected as we'll have multiple cold areas of low pressure dive in there. To the east, it's a far-stretching cold front, heavy rain, and risks of severe weather.